Hey everyone, today we're looking at Infiltration Quest Expansion. This is one of the most disappointing quests in Skyrim as I believe it was supposed to be a bigger quest that ended up as cut content. But now thanks to this mod it has been expanded considerably into what I consider one of my most epic quest expansions to date. Huge thanks to the mod author The Oscar and the voice actor James Cattle for their help making this quest come to life. The setup is simple. There's one fort and two old friends that want the fort for themselves. Who will get to keep the fort depends on the player and the quest has been expanded with tons of new dialogue, easter eggs, a new custom voice character, different endings, tons of player choices and more. Without further delay, let's jump straight into it. Those bastards. I returned from the war to find my home overrun with bandit filth. Help will arrive soon. Agreed, we can't afford to try again. Everything you see here has been recorded on the latest version of the mod pack Gate to Sovngarde, so if you like what you I'm see, consider getting the full mod pack. Oh, finally, reinforcements have arrived. I was expecting more, though. It better be good. We left to help with the war, and these filth bags swooped in and seized the place. My family is in there. I suspect Brewer had planned this. There's been bad blood between us since the king's death. But to invade my home, kidnap my family. You ask a lot of questions for a mercenary. Just get in there and open the gate. We'll try and provide help once that's done. I wish we could offer more help, but our last attack went sour, and we're all that is left. Good luck. He's a rogue mage who defected at the beginning of the war. I turned him in, but apparently he escaped. And now this. Well, all right, yes, I see your point. Come on. Lead the way. I've got your back. Don't worry. In Vanilla you gotta do the quest alone. With the mod however you may convince Taleo to come with you. This is by far the best path, so try to get him to come with you. Once you're inside, Stally and his guards will help you clear the fort and they also have a lot of custom reactions to everything that can happen inside the fort. Hey, that's mine. Take whatever you want, so long as you help me get rid of Brurit. Ebony armor. Good. I've been waiting. This game. Let's go. A little bit of meat for the road, and if you find Stalio's family dead, you will get new dialogue options and Stalio will be considerably angrier during the quest. Oh, no. My wife, she's dead. My son is dead. Damn them all to oblivion! I want vengeance. I'm going to track down that monster and murder him. Back off. 
What was that? Grab anything you can. Here he's supposed to react to you opening the storeroom, but one of the several bandit chiefs that are in this fort interrupted his dialogue. This is one of the few locations in Vanilla that have more than one bandit chief, and I assume Bethesda originally intended for you to come here with Stalio, but maybe they cut it from the game for lack of time. Small easter egg, if you cook or if you waste time around the fort, Stalio won't be happy about it. He's all about vengeance. He will also warn you about traps and pressure plates and what room is what, because, I mean, this is his fort after all. What are you doing that for? Come on, there's no time to lose. Careful with the trap. What was that? No heavy lifting. Did you hear something? Over here! What was that? You don't have what it takes to kill us. Why? Why? Damn elves. Just pay for this. Don't stand a chance. Time to end this. Sure have mercy on you. You now caught your tail. Oh. Prepare to die. Time to end this little game. I'll kill you. I cannot just. And now, off to the final confrontation. It. Now you get the choice to double cross Stalio or stay true to him. What are you doing here, Stalio? You miserable wretch. You brought this on us. You! Now you know how it feels to experience such treachery. You have gotten exactly what you deserve. You there. This man does not deserve your allegiance. He'll stab you in the back just as he did to me. Kill him, and I will reward you greatly. I'll kill you! So, what will it be? Together we can teach this traitor a lesson. So be it. Come on, you monster! I'll have your head. Another day. Sure, have mercy on you. Now, let's go on ahead. See if the way is clear. Careful, there's a pressure plate around here. So in Vanilla the gate can be easily opened from the outside, which breaks the entire quest, but I fixed this by blocking the window and the door, unless you come out from the inside of the fort. Now wait, this is
we did it! This is a great service you've done for me. I will not soon forget. My family. I... I need time to honor the fallen and reflect on my own life. Anyway, here is your reward. Thanks again. Alright, and with all the bandits from Brewery dead, the quest is now done. If Stalio and his bodyguards survive, then we'll stick around the fort to rebuild it. I'm telling you, I heard it. Howling. Those werewolf tales are <laughs> Yeah, yeah, they are. Which is much better, as in Vanilla, they just go back to their camp for no reason. If you bring mead, you're welcome here. Ah, even if you don't, you're still welcome. Thank you. Ismir's blessing on you. All we can do now is rebuild. What is that stench? Rotting wood, perhaps? That can't be good. It'll take time to rebuild. But the Nords are no strangers And this was but words. one of the many paths that you can take in this Until quest. Here's another one real quick. If you enter the fort without Stalio, you can decide to side with Brurit instead Who from the you? very beginning. What are you doing here? Is that so? You've made it awfully far for someone who is just looking around. I sense an element of tenacity about you. Perhaps you can solve a slight complication for me. Yes, you see, this fort initially belonged to a man named Stalio, a wicked wretch of an individual. But he wasn't always such a miserable creature. We were good friends, in fact. That was until he betrayed me and had me sentenced to an extended stay in prison. I digress. Stalio has returned. He wants his fort back. I want him dead. Do me this service, and I shall reward you. Excellent. Return to me once it is done, and I shall reward you. He should be just outside the main gate. My men have been keeping an eye on him. He still thinks he has some sort of claim to this fort. <laughs> Fool. Oh, come now. What an impertinent question. Surely you know better than to ask such things. I'm a wizard. They'll find any excuse to lock us up. It's jealousy, I'm sure of it. Are you here to help? No, the answer is no, I tell you. You understand me? What? My family is everything to me. I'll kill you! You're mine! You're mine! I cannot best you. Not like this. And also something interesting here is that the quest can result in both characters being alive at the end of it or even with both characters being dead. So this is perfect for people that like role-playing and having choices. Lastly, if you discover the dead family of Stalio, but still decide to side with Brurid, you can ask him about it. What is it that you need? Surely you have other matters to attend to? Hmm, an unfortunate bit of business, that. These bandits pushed them to their breaking point, I'm afraid. Played a little too rough, if you catch my meaning. I never intended for them to die. Finally, one less traitor in the world. It's a pleasure to see the work of someone so competent. Here is a reward befitting of the deed. Now, 
leave me in peace. Live comfortably in this unnecessarily large castle. Plenty of room for experiments and such. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the mod showcase and the mod, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.